Doctor, what is dysmenorrhea? Dysmenorrhea is pain in the belly or back which occurs during the menstrual periods. Up to 50% of all women have menstrual pain. For about 15% of them, the pain is so severe that they cannot continue with normal activities. It can disappear by itself or become less bothersome as you age or after delivery of a baby. Women usually develop menstrual pain one to two years after periods start. Doctor, what causes dysmenorrhea? The cause is thought to be high levels of prostaglandin, which is a chemical produced by the uterus, when the pain is caused by diseases such as fibroids or endometriosis, it is called secondary dysmenorrhea. Doctor, what are the symptoms of dysmenorrhea? Symptoms are cramping, tenderness, and sharp or dull pain in the lower abdomen that may spread to the lower back and inner thighs. Nausea, vomiting, diarrhea or constipation and headache may also occur. These symptoms usually begin the day blood flow begins and last one to three days. Symptom severity can vary, with cramping sometimes being mild and other times, severe. Doctor, how is dysmenorrhea diagnosed? The doctor will do a pelvic examination to make sure reproductive organs, uterus, ovaries, fallopian tubes, are normal. Blood tests and a vaginal ultrasound scan of the uterus and ovaries may also be done. The doctor may suggest seeing a gynecologist, who will check for other problems. A gynecologist is a specialist in diseases of the female reproductive system. Doctor, how is dysmenorrhea treated? Over-the-counter or prescription pain relievers help with pain. If one doesn't work, another may. Over-the-counter drugs include ibuprofen and naproxen. Taking birth control pills works well and makes bleeding lighter. It can take up to three months to notice a decrease in symptoms. Applying a heating pad or hot water bottle to the lower abdomen, taking hot baths, or massaging the area may help. Other treatments may include yoga, meditation and acupuncture for transcutaneous electrical nerve stimulation or tens a gentle electric current is applied to the skin, lunar or laparoscopic uterine nerve ablation can also be used if simpler measures fail. This is a surgical procedure done through a laparoscope which cuts the nerves which carry the pain impulses from the uterus to the nervous system. Doctor, what are the do's and don'ts in managing dysmenorrhea? Do exercise regularly, especially activities to strengthen lower abdominal muscles. Do try using heat, such as a heating pad, hot water bottle, or soaking in a hot tub. Do call your doctor if your dysmenorrhea becomes progressively worse, even with treatment. For more information log on to www.healthlibrary.com.